Now we are going to see how to solve a subtra subtraction question using a regrouping method. Okay. So the title will be subtraction with regrouping. So what do you mean by regrouping children? Regrouping means when we categorize the same item in one particular group. Okay. So here for you to understand, I am explaining you with an example. The example given here are out of 5000 people who came to circus, Sixteen, nineteen were children. Find the number of adults who came there. Okay, so now the very first thing is total number of people which is 5000 okay number of children which is equals to 1619 therefore number of adults Okay, so we will be subtracting to find the answer. So let's try to solve here. So the very first step, as I said, is we will be dividing it, it in the place value. Okay, minus 1619. Okay, so now what we are going to do is the borrowing system. Now, I know that 0 is less than 9 and I have told that my new end should always be larger than the subtrahend. It is not possible for me to reduce 0 from 9. So, what will I do is I will borrow from 10s. So, this when I borrow it will become 10. So, now is it possible for me to reduce 10 from 9? Yes, because 10 is larger than 9. So, 10 minus 1, 9 becomes 1. Okay. Now, since this has borrowed 1, so I will be reducing it by 1, right? Because I had borrowed 10s to the 1s place. So, this 10 will become as 9. Okay. So, 9 minus 1 is how much children? It's 8. Okay. Again, this will be reduced. Okay. And this will be 9 minus 6 is how much? It's 3. And this will be 4. 4 minus 1 is 3. Okay. So shall we add it and see whether our answer is right or wrong? Let's see here. So 3, 3, 8, 1. Plus 1, 6, 1, 9. 1 plus 9 is 10. 1 plus 8, 9. 9 plus 1, 10. 1 plus 3, 4. 4 plus 6, 10. 1 plus 3, 4. 4 plus 1, 5. So, which means that my answer is correct. So, 3,381 people were adults in this group of circus. Okay. So, what did we do children? First, we place them in their correct place value. After that, we borrowed it from the next place value. For example, in ones, if the number is short, I borrowed it from tens. Then I borrowed it from hundreds and then to the thousand. So by how many number I am borrowing it, that number we have to subtract when we come to the respective column. So this is called as solving the sums with regrouping formula.